Hi everyone. Today we're going to study sample spaces. Let us define sample space. An act of flipping coins, rolling dice, drawing cards, or surveying people are referred to as an experiment. A sample space of an experiment is the set of all possible outcomes. If two coins are tossed, we have the following four possibilities. H H H T T H and T T where H means head and T means tail. Each element of sample space is called sample point. Let us have more examples. Example 1. If a die is rolled, write a sample space. A die has six faces, each having an equally likely chance of appearing. Therefore, the set of all possible outcomes or sample space denoted by S is this. S equals 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. This is our final answer. Example 2. A family has three children. If B represents boy and G represents girl, then write a sample space. For our solution, the sample space consists of eight possibilities. And these are S equals BBB, BBG, BGB, BGG, GBB, GBG, GGB, and GGG. This is the answer. We can illustrate these possibilities with a tree diagram. By the way, a tree diagram is used in mathematics probability theory as a tool to help calculate and provide a visual representation of probabilities. The outcome of a certain event can be found at the end of each branch in the tree diagram. This is now the tree diagram. The S here is the sample space. We have here three columns of options. Each column represents the options for each child. For example, the first column represents the options where the first child may be a boy or a girl. The second column represents the options whether the second child is a boy or a girl. Look at this pair of BG here. It represents the options whether the second child is a boy or a girl, provided that the first child is a boy. The second pair of BG means the second child is a boy or a girl, provided that the first child is a girl. Now look at our last column, 
there are eight options here for B or G. Look at the first pair BG. This is the chance for the third child to be boy or girl, provided that the second child is a boy and the first child is also a boy. Now, the same pattern is true with all the other pairs. And at the end of the branch, we will write the outcome. For example, this B, B, B comes from this B, B, and B. This B, B, G comes from this B, B, and G. This B, G, B comes from this B, this G, and the B. So the same pattern is followed in the rest of the outcomes. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 outcomes here that are the same with our sample space that is written here. This is our final answer. Let us have example 3. Two dice are rolled. Write the sample space. For our solution, we assume one of the dice is red and the other is green. And we have the following 36 possibilities. We have a table here. The first column is numbered from 1 to 6, representing the outcomes for the red die. The top row is numbered from 1 to 6 also, representing the outcomes for the green die. And in our box here, it's written 1-1, one, one, meaning this is the outcome where the red die is 1 and the green die is 1. Another example is this 5-3. It means this is the outcome where the red die is 5 and the green die is 3. So in this table, there are 36 possibilities. This is our final answer. Example 4. Write the sample space for a deck of cards. This is a picture of the cards in a deck of cards. There is a total of 52 cards. There are 4 suits such as clubs, spades, hearts, and diamonds. Each suit has ace. Numbered cards from 2 to 10. Jack, Queen, and King cards respectively. Thus, 13 cards per suit are there. This is our final answer. I hope you learned something from this video. See you again next time.